So tonight for my dinner I'm going to make um, a bacon and cheese pasta bake. So the ingredients you'll need for this. Um, I try to trim off all the fat from the bacon. I've got three rashers there just to try and make it free but I have got still a bit of fat so I'm going to put one sin to cover myself from a weight loss. And I've got two half yays, so I'm using the light mature cheddar cheese, um, that's 80 grams. And I've got some tomato puree, one chopped up um, onion, one can of chopped tomatoes. I'm going to use some lazy garlic and this oriando seasoning. And I'm going to use some chicken stock. I weighed out my pasta, that's 200 grams. I've got some ballistic vinegar. Try that, splash of that in there. Salt and pepper. Yeah, let's get on. Okay, so first of all, I've got a saucepan um, filled with hot water and I'm just gonna place my pasta in. And I'm just gonna let that cook and then once it cooks, I'm gonna drain it and then set it to the side. Meanwhile, the pasta's cooking. I'm just gonna put in some water in the pan. And I'm going to, first of all, fry off my onion. So I'm just gonna wait for that water to heat up. So I'm just adding in my onions. I'm gonna have four tablespoons worth of this lazy garlic. Can't really do this one hand. Um, I'm just going to add in a bit more. So that's enough of that. And I'm going to add in the bacon. I'm going to let that fry for about two to three minutes. And now I'm going to add in the chopped tomatoes. And I'm going to let that cook for a further five minutes. Okay, now I'm going to add in 240 ml of chicken stock. And then I'm going to do two tablespoons worth of the tomato puree. So I'm just going to squeeze one. Two. Oh my god. How the <laughs> So funny I've just put all of it in there <laughs> oh my god I can't believe that happened right now I'm gonna do two tablespoons of oriango so it's been 20 minutes so I'm just gonna dish up all of this and put it in the casserole dish dish sorry <laughs> I'm gonna add in all the pasta oh it's all stuck <laughs> I'm gonna have to put my phone down and put it in sauce And then once all that mixed up, I'm going to put the grated cheese all over the top. I'm going to put the oven on to 200 Celsius. For, and then I'm going to leave it in the oven for about 20 minutes, just so the cheese melts on top. And I've also got some chicken nuggets, which is one cent each from Iceland to have it with. So I'm using my healthy extra A and it's in free. Looks delish. <laughs> 